Hey, walking down here, my third day in Abidjania, and my, I think it's the second day of uh, work. I was in bed for 24 hours, almost 22, I'd say. Then I ate lunch, then I did some meditation at the Casa. <clears throat> my voice is a little high pitched for some reason. Um, walking down the street here. Of, I mean, this street is leading up to that way is the Casa. Just a couple hundred meters that way. And uh, it's a nice park. Out of respect for the park, the house, and the work they do, I don't film there. I don't think I'm allowed to. Uh, so, uh, and uh, as you can see, you can buy you know, a lot of white clothing. Uh, we're told to wear white. This is the whitest I could find. <laughs> and I didn't. I was the least white person inside there out of hundreds of people. I think at least top three, five of the least white. Uh, drinking, you, you, you get to buy this water too. It's uh, John of God's blessed water. So he blesses the water and gives it energy. That's what I've been told, so that's what I'm gonna... Uh... My faith is really being put to the test here. Um, in these days here. But it, I mean, it makes sense that you can give water energy there's energy everywhere so why why not it's just embarrassing to talk about i feel no plans just jumping on a bus to abidjania this small little nowhere town uh, with no plans to stay you know i have no idea about anything and i just show up i'm the least prepared member of the participants here just looking at my clothing everybody's soaking white uh, and uh, I'm just here for a few days while most people are here for a couple of weeks and they pay thousands of dollars uh, for guides and I'm, uh, I'm just uh, by myself winging it for, for way cheaper like 20 times cheaper you know yeah it's, it's a little crazy a little too crazy now it's been uh, three months of craziness three and a half uh, so looking forward to get rooted in routines routines are the shit man uh, routines I miss that that's what's gonna give you craft traveling is what's gonna give you perspective appreciation open mind um, you get to remember who you are or that you're not limited to your to the role that you're playing in your local environment in your family and in your friend circle that's not the total of you so traveling reminds you of that you walk into the forest alone and you find out who you're not necessarily limited to okay and then you go uh, and then you can go back once you've had enough clarity you can go back to your home and really kick balls